right to the table and converses there with Barry Rosner and O.J. Silbel as we're ready to roll. Nice to see uh, the seniors from last year and a lot of kids from the last few years. So uh, Justin Etheridge, Jimmy John, Brian Chambers here last night. Jeff Kazarek here tonight. Greg Sefcek uh, taking the action in. And we're ready to roll as Mirandi will jump it up against Florian. The ball is in the air and the tap controlled by... The Dragons backcourt. Here comes Eric Henderson. Henderson bringing it up. Holding. Looking. Back out on top. Left side. Nice ball movement. Henderson. Kick it back out high. There's Topek. Topek on a drive. Pulls up. Uses the glass. Won't go. Mirandi claims the rebound. Here comes LH with Johnny King. Get it off to Mookie. Mookie bringing it up over the timeline. Heads to the left side. Mirandi. Kick it back out. King. Mookie with a little kick pass goes out of bounds. Looking across the way, see Wendy Kraft over there, Tammy Hirsch. At uh, good ball games, both of them did earlier here tonight when the girls won easily over Brownsville. Good ball game, though, for about three and a half quarters before LH put it away. Here's John, kick it to the corner, spotting up. John with an air ball, rebound, Hirsch, and he's got it. So LH has the lead at two to nothing. We'll give Sean an assist on that one. Say that was a pass. Up over the timeline now comes Henderson. Go to the left side. Jeremy Conley with it. Conley looking for the big guy. Florian gets it out here to Topek. Backdoor cut all alone. Nice work. Eric Henderson lays it in. Making a 2-2 ball game at the 650 mark. Here comes Mook now. Up over the timeline. Right side Hirsch and Ricky George indicates it's going the other way. So it'll stay here with uh, LH. And backcourt pass comes to Mark John. John will bring it up. Mirandi way out high. Three-point area. Kick it back out. King to John. Penetrating. Here's Hirsch. And the ball taken away. And Hirsch got it back. Kick it over here to Johnny King. Penetrating. Lucy driving in traffic. Lays it off. Ball loose. And Mirandi lost it, got it back. Here's a uh, turnover. Sean Lucy with the walk. 2-2 ball game. And up over the timeline now will come Eric Henderson. Henderson. To the corner. With it is Conley. And we got a foul on Mark John. Trying to play that tight. Pressure defense commits the first. Team foul number one. And the inbound feed will come. Eric Henderson, get it over here to Vancelo. Back it comes down to Henderson. Double team, penetrates. Defense breakdown. Shot tipped up and in. Number 41, Horace Topek with the tip. It's a 4-2 ball game. Now they're going to triple team. Ball down low to Mirandi. Hard drive, and he got it. Nice move by Matt. Tie ball game at four. Cradling the ball up over the line, Eric Henderson. 4-4 four, four at 5-30, first quarter. Good work here by Conley. Kopech, Vancelo, Henderson. Florian, the big boy, with the catch inside. Fade away off the look, won't get it. Rebound, put back up and in. No box out there as number 35 Conley makes it a 6-4 ball game. Mark John lobs it up ahead now. Ball almost stripped, stolen. Back to Mookie. He penetrates inside the arc, fires the J, and got it. So Mook, who had two last night, as his first shot get down clean and make it a 6-all ball game at the 455 mark. Pop out here now to Popek. Down low, and that'll be a foul on Johnny King, I believe. Ricky G with the call, and it's on number 12. King's first, team foul number two. And the inbound will come from Eric Henderson. Move it out here to Vancelo. Penetration, Henderson. Keeps it on the floor, gets in, fires, won't go. Good hard rebound, gets it back up, won't get it. Mirandi claims it all alone. Johnny King kicks it up another notch and lays it up and in. Good work by Mirandi. Got the outlet to King and make it an 8-6 ball game. Mustangs have the lead. Second.
second time they've led here tonight. Vancelo with it. Kick it back out. Number 41, Horace Topek. To Florian. Left side. Here's Henderson. Spotting up. Firing. No good. Loose ball. Rebound Mirandi off the deflection to King to John. Four minutes to go. Game moving at a nice pace. Not a whole lot of whistles. Hirsch puts it up and walked. And Mirandi will sit down. Mike Hicks will check in. Three fifty two to go. Skip it out high. There with it is Henderson. Corner to Conley. Vancelo. Kick it back out. Spotting up for three. Won't drop. Man, that's gonna be on the back. Sean Lucy claims the rebound and Jeremy Conley with the foul. Three thirty to go. Eight six is your score. Robbie Davis down here to our right watching the ball game. If it's Donnie Santor, it might be. At the 320 mark, LH up a deuce. King to John. Inside to Hicks. Nice little move. Gets by everyone. Lays it up and in. So LH with a four point lead now. Mike Hicks has a deuce. LH up 10 6 with 3.11 to go. Penetration, left wing, Kopech, holding it, drive now, spin, pretty move, but short, good effort by Jeremy Conley, keeps it alive, got it back into Vancelo, and he went for the pass, and he drew the foul, 2.46 to go, 10-6 ball game, not a whole lot of whistles here, game is moving along pretty quickly, let's see if it's on the floor, and I think it was, are they going to say a shooting foul, I really thought he was trying to pass. Jerry Dupay nods affirmatively to my left and says, yeah. And I guess they're going to line up in a shooting situation. Vancelo was definitely, I thought, trying to angle the ball off to the right side. So he's at the line. And Bill Vancelo, who had one in the losing effort against the Raiders last night, will either hoop from 15 and miss it badly. 10-6 at the 2.46 mark. Second one coming. On the way, and this one is there. So, made a three-point game at the 245 mark as Mark John will bring it up for LH. Mark coming up. Want to remind you, this game will be seen tomorrow night on Channel 52. And here's a steal. LH throws it away. Here's Vancelo. Byron won't get it. Ball tipped around. Rebound loose. Henderson's got it. Back out to the big guy. He's in. He kicks it to the corner. And Topek fires. No good. Strong tip. And uh, just checking in, Sean Matthews with a nice put back. At the two-minute uh, mark, it's a 10-9 LH lead. Right side, John. And ball deflected away. Hirsch deflected, stolen, and here they come again. Ball loose on the deck. Going to be a tussle inside, and the possession arrow goes where? To LH, and I think Coach Henry Bullard wants a timeout. Timeout on the court. We'll be back at the 155 mark. LH up 10-9. Head Council. We're back and ready as the inbound feed comes to King, and it's stolen away. Turnover. Gets it in the hands of Eric Henderson at the 149 mark. Henderson brings it up. Go to the right side. Penetration, it's going to be short, follow 
Halifax, left side Henderson. Henderson, get it to the big guy, Florian. Puts it on the floor, holds. Henderson with it with a minute to go. He's on a drive, gets in, nice move. He's got four, and the lead is three at 13-10. Here comes Mark John up over the timeline. Mook trying to go deep to the corner, does. They rotate it around to Perry. Perry to the corner to Sean Lucy. Inside Mirandi, and what do we got? We got a foul on 35, I believe. That's Conley. That's his second. He reached in at the 45-second mark. Lucy to inbound it. Get it to Mark John. Mark lob it cross court to Gaddis. Gaddis wants some help. Get it down. And on the deck with it, it's loose. LH trying to get it, and we got uh, LH turning it over. As number 42, Mike Hicks got tied up on the sideline and laid on the uh, end line. So LH will head back on the defense. Off the bench will come Vancelo, and he will check in, replacing Jeremy Conley. Number 23, Sean Matthews, will inbound with 34 seconds to go and a three-point lead. The Dragons on top. They may hold out here. They're near midcourt. They're just going to sit out there at the 26-second mark. Get it out of the corner to Vancelo. Back. Ball almost stolen. Vancelo recovers. Gets it to Henderson. Good ball movement. Patiently with it. Working to the 10-second mark. Here's Henderson. Down to eight. They're going to get the last shot. They lob it into the big guy. Nice little touch pass back. The three on the way at the buzzer. Beautiful ball movement and a three-pointer by Eric Henderson. And we've come to the end of the first quarter, 16-10. The Dragons on top. We'll be right back. The second quarter, John Kazarek for Q99. Jerry DePay to my left for the South Union Township Sports Network. This ball game will be seen Monday evening at 6 o'clock on Helicon Channel 52. I want to remind you that the... Uh, First night's doubleheader featuring the Phillies and the Mustangs will be seen Sunday night. That's tomorrow at 6.05. And then the girls' championship game, with which LH won just a few minutes ago, will be on Wednesday night. So we got a whole host of activity coming your way. Out now with it. As we start the second quarter, 16-10 ball game. Good ball movement here by the Dragons. Vancelo gets it in. Pretty pass down low. They overthrew. The steal by King. Up they come. Mookie with a skip pass to Sean inside Hirsch. Little fadeaway is around and good. Nice work there by Nick Hirsch. He's got four. And up over the timeline, here comes Eric Henderson. Eric, corner. Right side, Conley. Conley penetrates, pulls up, fires halfway down, won't go. Good strong rebound, the big boy working hard, double pump. Once, twice, Hirsch battling it among the trees and comes out of there. We got a foul. Good call. Ricky George is Dan Florian battling awfully hard on the glass. Very aggressive kid. Gets a nod of appreciation from Henry Bullard over here. I'll tell you, all the races have some good ball clubs, and uh, the name Bullard uh, rings some bells. He's done a good job down there. 6.50 to go. 16-12, second quarter. Mustangs down four. Trailed it by six at the quarter. Here's Mookie to King. Back to Mookie, and he has the ball stripped away from behind, but deflected to King to Hirsch. Inside, now he throws it away again. Now, has got to be a little more patient, and they're not going to get uh, a whole lot in that frantic pace that we had last night. I think they've got to be a little more controlled in uh, a possession-conscious type ball club. Up over the line, here comes Henderson. That's not the L.A. style through the years, but I think at times you have to adjust and adapt. Here's Florian. Nice move. Oh, did everything but finish it off. Hirsch with the rebound. Got it to Mookie. Mookie way up ahead to Johnny King. Stop. Changes in midair. Little hook pass inside, and Hicks lays it up and in. There's what we've got to do. We've got to move the ball and get the open man. Don't force. And a nice work uh, by King that time to feed uh, Hicks down low. Here's Lucy almost with a steal. One-handed runner won't go by number 35, Conley. Rebound down to Hicks. Skip it up ahead. Lucy on a reverse, and we are dead even. Nice work there. Sean with his first deuce. Tied at 16. 
twice. Finally, Hurst with another rebound. And Ellis throws it away. Oh, nice hustle by Mookie. As he got back, it was going on its way out, and he was able to save it. Got it back in bounds and off of the uh, Alder Ice Dragon. So good play by John. LH trying to get it in. They get it over here to Phoenix. Ben just checked in. Mark John spots up Lucy, and this one will not go. Rebound taken off by uh, Jason Gray. Get it up ahead to Eric Henderson. Henderson inside the three. Fires won't go. They battle on the glass, and we have got a whistle. At the 404 mark. And the push will go against uh, Jason Gray. Dennis Garrett, Ricky George, you are your officials here tonight with 404 to go. It's a 20 to 18 ball game, midway in the second quarter. Up over the line. Bounce it to Mirandi. Mirandi lost it. Mark John got it back. Skip it over here to Lucy. Lucy fires and scores. Nice work by Sean. He's got four. Here they come at the 341 mark. Left side. Florian. Moving to Topek. Horace Topek. Nice cut. Oh, he had him all alone. And Eric Henderson just couldn't hang on to it. Ricky George earlier this afternoon saw his fifth and sixth grade Marshall Ball Club uh, win the championship down at the South Union Township Rec Center. An overtime ball game. It was one of the better ones that uh, we've had all year long. He came from eight back in the closing minutes to tie it and win it in OT. So a great game there. We really enjoyed that one. Good ball movement. Hirsch to Mirandi to John. Hirsch on the floor. Move it around Mookie. Mirandi penetrating. Mirandi with a banker. Won't get it. Rebound off. Taken down here by Henderson. It's a three-minute mark. Topek. Move it around. Sean Matthews on the right wing. Gray down low. Florian on the high. Post, backdoor cut. They lost it. Matthews got it back off of deflection and hung right in there. 22-20 with 2.44 to go. Willie White, an interested observer on the sideline. He's got a sprained ankle and will not play. Hopefully he'll be ready Tuesday. Here's a three on the way by John. Off, no good, and stays with Union L.A. Shredder. Off the bench, here comes Mike Hicks. And Mirandi coming out. A big guy at a of year in football. Out here to John. Corner to Lucy. John with it. Phoenix. Inside. Nice pass. Ben, and what do we got? Basket is good. If Lucy hits the deck hard. Nice pass by Phoenix. Lucy with the possible three-point play the old-fashioned way at the 224 mark. And let's see off the bench. Number 43, Jeff Wright. He'll check in for Jason Gray. Game tied at 22. Lucy's had a nice quarter, six in the quarter. Dad is coming in. I think Mark John will sit down. Chance to take the lead. Will not drop. Lucy got the rebound back to Venick. Phoenix to Perry, spin it around to Hicks. Hicks on a drive, fires it up, won't go. Ball tipped around, Lucy keeps it alive. Kick it around, Hicks battling hard against Florian in there. What a contact. Phoenix now. Ball tipped, Gaddis got it back to Hicks. Send it back outside. Lucy with the three, long rebound. Good hustle, Sean, as he tracked it down. Those threes will give you those long rebounds. Here's Phoenix spotting up out of the corner. Oh, halfway down, won't go. And there's a putback by number 42, Mike Hicks. So LH takes the lead at 24-22. Coming to the sideline, Ricky George indicates the hoop is good. And LH has the lead. We'll again be on the air Wednesday night. Uh, George Jr. Republic coming in. That'll be a test. I don't have the schedule in front of me. Donnie, did we play Tuesday night also, correct? Shot is
goes up and in. And where is that? Who? Okay, the girls are home Monday night. The boys are home Tuesday and Wednesday. Inbound feed coming. Up over the timeline now. LH on top three. After the three-point play. Kick it back over here. Head of the circle now is Henderson. 1.35 to go. LH up three. Matthews with it against Phoenix. Move it back around. On the deck, Henderson with a little fade away. Will not go. Hirsch up strong on the glass. Nice work, Nick. King spotting up. And no. Rebound will go to the Dragons. I tell you, this is a much improved effort here tonight for Laurel Highlands as Mark John checks in with 1.11 to go. Here comes Eric Henderson. Go to the left side with it. Topek. Looking for help. I think I might have said Kopech one time, but he's going to have a nice year. We hope rebounding from that injury down at AG. That's going to be a fine, fine ball club. Eddie Andrews is going to send out. Go to the left side to right. Right, looking for help. Inbounds it in the lane. Shot put up and in. Eric Henderson, who had 22 last night, is well on his way again. He's got 13 already. 38 seconds to go. 25-24. LH up one. Here comes Mark. Get it over here to Sean on a cut. Phoenix. Lucy for three on the way. Yeah, Sean, light it up. Lucy with nine. And the Mustang lead is four. That's as big as it's been. 15 seconds to go. Kick it back, Henderson for three on the way, won't drop. There's Hurst with another rebound and a foul. This should send LH to the line, and Hurst will go there. It has four, and we'll be shooting one and one. Nice effort. I'll tell you, LH looking so much sharper here tonight than they did last night. Didn't play with anywhere near this uh, efficiency last night. A little more patient, a little more controlled, a little more composed. And it adds up to uh, a much better uh, finished product on the floor, no doubt about it. At the line, Hirsch. Getting ready to send it on its way, and no. So the loose ball on the deck. Mark John with a little fade away, and he hit the deck, and he'll go to the line to shoot two with one second to go. Good work by Mark. So a four-point lead could become six right here. Good hustle by Mark. Go to the line to shoot two. Never give up on it. And the free throw coming. And he got it. So they'll make it a five-point lead. Let's get it to six. On the way, and no. And that'll do it. We've come to the end of the first half of action. Laurel Highlands on top, 29-24. I'm John Kazarek, and we'll be back with halftime activity after this break. Uh, George Jr. Republic won the state, I believe, double-A title, and Billy was telling me they've got uh, three or four starters coming back, so that is going to be a tough chore. Then Friday, we go up to Kiski away, and I'll have more on the broadcast schedule as it unfolds. We will be doing the ball game, I believe, Wednesday night on TV, and we're ready to roll. As the quarter gets set to go, both ball clubs have taken the floor, and we are underway as Mook John will bring it up over the timeline. Get it to Johnny King. Kick it to the corner to Lucy. Lucy in the corner. Lucy lost it and slides and covers it up. And this should go to George Jr. Uh, George Jr. I got that on my mind. This will go over to Alderdice. So Alderdice has the ball as we are just moments into, seconds into this uh, third quarter. 29-24. They go to the right side to Topek. The big boy Florian, he had 22 against Uniontown. Only had two here tonight in the first half. Good hustle by Eric Henderson. LH with Hirsch, Lucy, John, King, and Mirandi out there. 
Brick this one. Second one coming.
15 minutes between 6 a.m. and 9.15 a.m. And if conditions are extreme, we'll bring you the cancellations or delays the night before so you can sleep in on those cold, snowy mornings. That's right. Keep your radio tuned at Q99 WPQR for the latest in school delays, closings, and early dismissals. Coming up this is from a video of Monty Wright. Monty Wright, a bright future at 18, killed by a drunk driver at 19. Do whatever it takes. Friends don't let friends drive drunk. An appeal from the Ad Council, the Department of Transportation, and this station. Mark John brings it up to Vinic. Spin it around. Vinic inside. Nice move. Hicks there. Get lay it up and in. Mike has 11. Jason Gray will come off the bench. It's a 33-32 ball game. Move it around. Florian. Eric Henderson. Eric driving in, Eric lost it, got it back, his shot is short, they battle inside, nice save, they get it out here to Vancelo, Vancelo looking in fine, and Eric Henderson, 3.17 on a running clock, 33.32 is the score in favor of the Dragons from Alderdice, City League School in Pittsburgh. Backdoor cut, Henderson will hold it, get it to the big guy, rotate it around to Topek, Here's Florian, putting it on the floor, gets by Hirsch, gets in, fires and scores. So Florian with five now, and the lead goes back to three at 35-32, 2.50 to go. Hicks, Beanick, John, Lucy, and Hirsch. Sean fires up an air ball with a rebound. It's Hicks, and he'll go to the line to shoot two. Nice job by Hicks, he got the inside position. 51, Jason Gray coming in, 55, sitting down. That'll be Dan Florian. Thirty-five off the bench, Jeremy Conley. He'll replace Horace uh Opec. Gary Gatt is getting ready to come in. Sean Lucy will take a breather. 35-32 is your score. Not on the way. No good. Second one coming. On the way and got it. So the hoop right there by Hicks. And we've got a two-point ball game after the one free throw. 35-33, Alderdice leading it with 2.30 to go. Drive and shoot, scorn, but a good call by Ricky George. It was on the floor as he started his drive, and Feeney grabbed as he went by. And really a fortunate uh, move because he was home free for the lay-in. So they inbound it, get it out here to Henderson. Spin it to Conley. He's got it, and he drew the foul from Hirsch. So Jeremy Conley, number 35, as Lucy gets ready to come in. Harry's going to sit down. Make it a four-point game. So LH led it by five at the half. They've been outscored by nine. And as the lead now goes to six. Or goes to five, rather. 38-33. Three-point play there. Lucy penetrating, passes it to Hirsch, out high to Hicks, to John, move it around to Vinick, inside Hirsch, goes up and drew contact, so Hirsch will go to the line. Number 32, Nick Hirsch. This is Hirsch across the way, very intently focusing in on this uh, free throw here by Nick. Perry checks 
short with it. Go get another one. He's got four, had seven last night. I tell you, boys and girls both, we got to work on our free throw shooting. Second one, this one is clean. So one of two for Nick. Press goes on, and they get it in. Up to Henderson now, the lead is four. Henderson breaks it, move it back around. Shot on the way, won't go. Up on the glass, the shot is good, but uh, Jason Gray was fouled. And I think he'll go to the line for the one and one. And O.J. Silbon indicates right there to Ricky George, one and one it is. Good to see some local officials working ball games here. Ricky G working this one. We saw Wolfie and uh, Danny Hanna work the girls game or the uh, boys game last night, I believe. And to the line. Oh, this one is way off the mark, but the big guy is there to take the rebound and a held ball. Whose ball is it? LH's. 154 to go. Doug Klingen worked the first game. There's some good officials in this area, no question about it. Up over the line, Mark John. Sean Lucy. Tossed out of bounds, but touched by the Dragons. 147 to go, 38-34 your score. Inbound feed goes all the way into the backcourt. It's stolen. Coming in to lay it up easily for the hoop is Eric Henderson. As he stole the long inbound pass and makes it a six-point ball game now. Inside, Mirandi on the floor. Lost the ball. Hurst got it back in among the trees. Lays it off Lucy, and he got it. Good work there by Hurst to get it to Lucy. And the lead is four. Press comes off with 1.20 to go. 40 to 36, third quarter score, Alderdice up four. Move it around to Henderson, Henderson holding. Henderson kicking it back out to Jason Gray. Looking, Florian on a drive, gets in, muscles his way there. Missed the easy lay-in, and the rebound, they get it back. Good hustle, Conley tipped out of bounds by Sean Lucy. Good work by Conley to keep it alive. 49 seconds to go, and off the bench, Horace Topek, number 41, getting ready. He replaces Jeremy Conley, number 35. Inbound, and he walked with it. The pass went into Jason Gray, and he's got an ankle problem, I believe. Hicks checking in. Nope, he'll set at the table until the next whistle with 44 seconds to go. Mark John. Up over the line, LH down four. Johnny King. Oak. Pick it to Sean. Long distance three. Will not go. Rebound tip. Here comes Henderson against Mark John, and he walked with it. Nice pass down low, but he shuffled his feet. Off the bench comes number 43, Jeff Wright. Gray will sit down. Jeremy Conley, one of the starters on the bench. They've got uh, some new people out there. Here's Lucy. The King. To Mook. Inside Mirandi. To Lucy. His shot and a foul. 12 seconds to go. Lucy will go to the line. Sean with 9, 10, 12 on the night. Hicks with 9, 10, 12 on the night, and Hirsch with 5. Everybody else with 2 or 3. That's been it. They're at the line, Lucy, trying to go for that Baker's dozen, and Will, as he nails it. Chance to cut this lead to just 2 going into that fourth quarter. Off the bench comes Rusty King, number 14, the sophomore. Second one coming on the way, and no. Rebound tipped and saved. They get it to Lucy, out to King. King lost it, and we got a foul. Mark John will come in. And LH with seven seconds to go. We'll have it. Not in the bonus, so the Mustangs will inbound it. At quarter court on the side, Lucy will... Throw it in. A three-pointer would tie. A two-pointer would get it to within one. Having some trouble getting it in, 
the buzzer spotting up and firing from 16 feet. The big guy, Florian, makes it a three-point game again at 42-39. Now the pressure comes on. Get it to Johnny King, the Mook. And get it over here to King. King with a skip pass to Hicks. Hicks on a drive, and he walked. The turnover gets it over here and out of order. Dice 42-39, three-point ball game. With it is Conley. Put it on the floor, picked it up. Needs some help, throws it away. And the big boy Florian picks it up. Running in, fire no good. Got it back, fires again. They're banging hard. Florian just claiming everything. And he's going to be fouled by Hicks. So this should send him to the line for one and one. I'll tell you, Florian just doing a heck of a job on the glass. So Hicks picks it up. He's not in any kind of foul trouble. Let's see who they send to the line. I'll tell you what, that's, uh, no, okay. I've got him at one and one, and actually maybe the two-shot foul. So going to the line is Florian. So let's see if it's the one and one or the bonus after the tenth foul, I believe. No, it's one and one. Up, oh, no good, but the rebound comes down to number 21, Vancelo. Get it back to Florian. They got it to the guy they want with it now is Henderson at the seven-minute mark. 42-39. Out high. Florian on the floor, driving, firing, and missing. Rebound, Mirandi. Mirandi gets it up ahead. Johnny King running the break. Moves in, pretty pass, and we got a held ball on the floor. A little scrap going on. And LH will get it on the possession arrow. 42-39 with 6.36 to go. Much improved effort here tonight. Get it to Mark John. Mirandi. Oh, he had it picked. Coming hard with it now. And shooting no good. The follow is right there off the miss of Henderson by Topek. So the lead goes to five with 6.20 to go. Here's Johnny King. Tricky dribbling up the left side and throws it away. But Lucy comes out of there with it. And did he walk or was he fouled? We got a foul. And off the bench comes Hirsch. Miranda will sit down. Number 43 out of here. Jeff Wright getting ready to check in. 51 Jason Gray moves up near the coach, so I would assume he's coming in shortly. So Lucy's at the line. Let's see if he's there for two or is it the one and one? One and one, says Ricky George. Free throw. Perfect by Sean. First points of the quarter. And Dragons' lead is cut by one, and the rebound comes down off the miss. Taken down, and a lot of contact. Possession arrow goes to Alderdice on the held ball. So 44-40 is what we've got it at. They get it into the big guy, Florian, on Lee. Bringing it up now, comes Vancelo. And did he go over and back? He did. Good defense by Johnny King. So with the basketball, King will inbound it. Get it out here to Mark John. Johnny King, Mark John. 5.55 to go, four-point lead, shot on the way, Johnny King buries the tray, a baby, John. So the lead now is just one, up over the line, here comes Eric Henderson, go to the left side to Vancelo, move it around, baseline, holding, looking, Florian, it is fouled by Lucy. Off the bench comes Sean Matthews. 5.28 to go. 44-43. Lucy picks the foul up. And out of the lineup comes number 21, Bill Vancelo. Number 55, Florian at the line. The 
a good win for us if we can get it. Shot is up and good. So the lead goes back to two. At 45-43, the second one coming. Earn the bonus. And will not get it, but there's the rebound. Good hustle there by Conley to keep it alive. Get it to Anderson. So we did not box out there. Matthews with it. Matthews looking for some help. Get it to Florian. Over here now with it to Henderson. Henderson, nice little touch pass. Left-handed shot of beauty by Florian on a pretty pass inside. So he's become a force here now. All of a sudden, again, it's back to four. John DeKing. Mark will fire on the way. It's short. Rebound loose. Florian battling awfully hard. And we got a held ball. Should go to L.H. Hicks and Florian. Tie up with it. 4.54 to go. Four-point ball game. So the possession arrow gives it to L.H. Get it to John. Move it around. Johnny King. Throws it away, but Hirsch gets it back and stays with L.H. Good work by Hirsch. Hink, Mark John, Hirsch, Hicks, Lucy. The lineup at the 445 mark, and the Dragons on top four. Outside, Mark John with a three. Will not go, and Florian on the grass and comes out of there, and we got another held ball, but this one will go to the uh, Dragons. Now the press comes on. They, they want the ball in the hands of Henderson. Oh, he broke free all alone. And he's coming down in. Pulls up, spins, fires, and a foul. I tell you, no one got back, and we're lucky he didn't take it all the way in and lay it in. Better react to just a second sooner. It would have been an easy uh, lay-in. So Henderson's at the line. Miranda will check in. Hicks will sit down. It's a 47-43 game now. Dragons by four, could get it to six. They've got it to five. Now for the young man at the line, and make it 23 as he hits them both. So Henderson, who had 22 against Uniontown, has 23 here tonight. Mark John bringing it up, all of a sudden the lead is six. Mirandi, posting up now. Looking for the ball inside to King. Three on the way. Won't go. Down they come. Henderson. Matthews. Conley. Kick it back. Now, good ball rotation here. Good ball movement. Four minutes and five seconds to go. Matthews. Put out here now to Jeff Wright. There's the man they want with it. That's Henderson. Henderson, a fine player. The big boy, 15-footer, got it. So Florian, who was awfully quiet early, is in double figures. He's got 12, and 10 of them have come in this second half. Johnny King, the lead now is 8, 51-43. Mark John for 3. Missed it. Get it back, Johnny King. LH has gotten away from what they were doing well. They're spiring up some threes here lately, and here's Mark John. Has it blocked. He got in too deep. Rebound coming. Here's Matthews. Give it up, and he walked with it as he tried to hang it over there to Jeremy Conley. And I tell you, we're lucky there because that would have been a 10-point lead. They had the two-on-one. He just didn't give it up fast enough. Bradcliffe down to our right watching the ball game. Got his young son Craig with him, I believe. Inside, they skip it back, and take it away. L.H. Turning it over now a bit at the three-minute mark. And running down the floor, number 35, Jeremy Conley never looking. You cannot do that. And Coach Bullard is upset. He'll get a timeout. Timeout on the floor, and we'll be back. 2.59 to go. L.H. down eight. Floor so you can sleep in on those cold, snowy mornings. That's right. Keep your radio tuned at Q99 WPQR for the latest in school delays, closings, and early dismissals. As we come back, Mark John bringing it up. Skip to the right side to Hirsch. LH down eight. 
Hurst puts it on the floor, penetrates, get it to Lucy. He wanted to load it up and fire. Good defense, cut him off. Here's King. Down low to Mark. Mark going to whip it outside here to Lucy for three. And it will not go, and we got a foul. So this could be three at the line for Lucy. This effectively could be a three-pointer. That's three shots, says Ricky G. Ricky George, Dennis Garrett, your officials here tonight. So this is a critical uh, situation here. Sean at the line. Three. Could be big. First one. Got it. Second one. No. So the lead is seven. Hicks getting ready to come back in. And the third one. Yeah, two out of three. And make it a six-point ball game. Inbound will come. They're going to want to get it to Henderson, I'm sure. And there he is with it. You know, that's Topek, rather. Now, here's Matthews. Get it to Henderson. Henderson coming up over the line. Down to two and a half to go, and the lead is six. Henderson working. Vancelo and Henderson out high. Topek pops out behind the screen. Good ball movement. Move it over here now to Conn. Inside all alone. They work it beautifully. And Vancelo with an uncontested easy lay into the lead is back to eight. Here's Johnny King now. Back court. Throws it almost away. And the ball ripped down. Coming hard on a drive all the way to lay it up. And Henderson gets it to go. And a big, big basket there to make it a 10-point ball game. 55-45 with 1.56 to go. We'll keep it right here. And the end of the section. And here comes Mark John. And Ringgold always, as we said. Connell's real tough. Here's Hicks. Did he walk? No. So he'll go to the line. Got one new team in the section this year. Okay, McKeesport, okay. I'm thinking new team. I saw the MAHS, that's McKeesport Area High School. How can you forget McKeesport? They've been as good as any in uh, this section for quite a while. So Hicks at the line. Shooting a pair. And to the sideline goes Horace Topek. I don't know if he fouled out or not. 43, Jeff Wright has come in. So 148 to go. Not on the way, no. Second one coming. Deteriorate into a foul shooting contest here, I would think. LH is going to have to start fouling here very shortly. And the free throw is up and good. So Vini checks out, checking in. Comes uh, King. So the inbound will come in. They get it in to Henderson. Skip it over here. Matthews, Vancelo, lost it and tipped it out of bounds. So the pressure defense creates a turnover. And up comes Sean Matthews, Mirandi coming in. So an offense for defense substitution here now. So down to a minute 39 to go. L.A. needs a hoop on his possession. And he just checked out. He's checking back in. I think he's got to, yeah, he's got to sit here for a second. Make the uh, ball in the hands of John now. Down to 136, 135, 134 and counting. The lead is nine. They get it to Lucy. Lucy to King. 127 to go. And tip stolen away. And Matthews has got it. Another turnover, and that'll kill you. Up over comes Matthews. Get it over here to the right side now to Conley. Conley just going to hold it there. And Johnny King will foul him. 112 to go. And it's a nine-point ball game. Vini coming in. John King coming out. To the line goes Jeremy Conley. This could hurt if he gets it up uh, to 11. Shooting. Bonus. And no. So three threes could still tie it, of course. Hurst getting ready to come in. And in and out won't go. And there's the big guy, Florian, snuck in back door and got a rebound. And the clock is at a minute now. Here comes Henderson. Skip it down low 
52 seconds to go. Nice job by Florian to start that exchange as he was able to sneak uh, in the back door and get a rebound. So they're right where they were. Chance to get it to 11, but uh, about 10 more seconds have come off the clock. Ready to come in is Bill Vancelo. So you've got Vancelo and Henderson. 23 Matthews, 35 Conley comes out. Florian is at the line. Not on the way, in and out. Will not go, so they have not capitalized on these free throw opportunities. This could make it a 10 and does not. But there they are again, Vancelo. But uh, the rebound comes down to Vini. Good hustle. Here's Lucy for three. Won't go. Florian claims the rebound, gets hits the deck, and a held ball. Arrow points to LH with 40 seconds to go and a nine-point lead. Timeout called on the floor, and we're going to break. 55-46 in favor of the uh, Modern Ice Dragons, and we'll be back. Remember a little love, and you'll create memories they'll never forget. A thought from the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Here's Lucy. John to Mirandi to turn around. No, and a rebound, Matthews, and a foul. 32 seconds to go. There's young Greg Sefcik getting ready to leave. Nice to see Greg, a freshman up at Penn State. Line. We'll go Eric Henderson. He's got 23-25 on the night, and if he hits these two, if it's not over already, I think that would just about lock it up. Gaddis coming in. Mark John will sit down. So Gaddis has checked in. Free throw is up and no good. Henderson will shoot the second now. On the way, and this one nestles in. Ten-point ball game with 31 seconds to go. Here's Gaddis on the fly. Byron got the three. That a boy, Perry. And LH will take a timeout. So Perry Gaddis comes in off the bench and hits the tray. And the lead is now cut to seven. It's not at a screen. Get it to Matthews. Matthews immediately gets it right back. And a foul by Gaddis. 23 seconds to go in the seven-point ball game. 56-49. To the line will go Eric Henderson. He's got ten field goals. One three to this point. And... Gets it up and in. So that makes it a 57-49 game. And got them both. So those were big. Might have been the final nail in the coffin. Here comes Hicks. Straight down the lane, and he walked with it. So that should do it at 58-49. Now they just dug themselves too deep a hole in this fourth, fourth period and unable to come back all the way. The inbound right here, thrown away, but Florian's got it. Gets it back behind to Henderson with 15 seconds to go, and Gaddis commits the foul. So Henderson's going to go to the line again for two more. He's already been there six times. He's converted five of six, so this is a two-shot. Give him eight trips to the line. And shooter's roll, got it. Second one. And he got them both. Seven of eight at the line. Gaddis to Lucy, leaning in, and he fires and scores with six, five, four seconds to go on a foul. So Sean Lucy gets the hoop, and that's going to do it with... A nine-point deficit facing LH here. Four seconds to go. At 
the line again. Shot on the way up and good, so LH down now, 60 to 51. Second one coming and will not go. The rebound loose. Lucy's got it. He'll fire from midcourt, and that, my friends, will do it. Final score, 61-51. LH loses it by 10 to go 0-2. I'm John Kazarek. We'll be back with a very quick post-game wrap-up right after this. Have a good